have the numbers for Black Panther Wakanda Forever. And this movie is doing worse than the first movie. It is doing worse than Doctor Strange. Doctor Strange has been made the biggest opening of the year since it opened on the 8th of May. But Black Panther's sequel gets a pass on Monday. And Marvel wants to get against but kind of potential itself. But this movie... It'll be the first movie to open the 100 million because, of course, people, you know, people will watch them, these Marvel movies, over and over again. I just don't get it. I really don't get it. Okay. But this movie is going to open below Doctor Strange's 44 of Madness. It's commanding 144 million, 24 million box office opening after Huge Friday. It's funny when they talked about Black Adam, they said, they, they said, oh, Black Adam was guaranteed to make $58 million, $62 million, and overperformed that. Or Sonic 2 is guaranteed to make $63 million. But oh, oh, it's Marvel. We can have ranges for Marvel. Okay? But not any other movie, of course. Not any other movie. Marvel, you know, Jurassic World, oh, it's guaranteed to open to that, that number. Batman. Okay, no, but Black Panther, oh, it's, it's a range, okay, it's a range, okay, if we, we gotta make some Disney makes, you know, we gotta keep our expectations with Marvel, okay, but this movie is going to make 174 million and 184 million domestically, which is below Doctor Strange's numbers, it will not match the first movie's opening, and it will, and it will likely open to around four of funders' numbers, which is not too good. This movie will probably have pretty bad rigs, just like the last two Marvel movies released. I wonder, because a lot of people are saying this movie's garbage. That's like Four of Them Thunder, that's like, you know, Doctor Strange, Baltic Force, and Midness, and all the shows that Marvel keeps releasing that nobody watches. And this, and this is a show, this is a movie that nobody cares about, besides the normies. The only thing that's keeping Marvel alive are most of the normies. The normies will go watch anything that has Marvel on it. I don't get why. But they will. Okay. They will. Normies will go watch anything with Marvel on it. Okay. But this movie isn't really doing too well on IMDb 7.4. Which is actually, I think, below the first movie. And on Metacritic. Rick, which, you know, <clears throat> as well, only has a 6.0. Because, of course, the Marvel fanboys are going to give it a high reviews. But, you know... This movie isn't really doing as well as they probably thought it would. They probably would have thought this would make, you know, this would make, oh, 450 million dollars or something like Spider-Man made. And this movie costed 250 million dollars to make. I really want to see how it opens as well. But I think we got to really wait into the second weekend for this movie. Because the second weekend for this movie might not be all too great as well. So Black Panther, Wakanda Forever, you know, it's not really as compelling to here. So box office as well. You know, Black Panther. They had they, they have a range for Black Panther, don't worry. But for Sonic 2, uh for Uncharted, for every other movie. Oh yeah, we have a fixed number for the movie. Cause they wanna keep the expectations high for the inevitable underperformance of this movie. The the you know the point thirty percent we can drop week to week drops. They were going to be seen for this movie, the 50 to 60 percent week to week drops, like every superhero usually opens to. Yeah. And yeah, Black Adam also dropped 42 percent, but Black Adam isn't really doing too well at the box office because, of course, they spend so much money on these movies <coughs> that. People, you know, are not going to care about them, okay? You know, they overestimate a movie's popularity a lot of times now because, of course, people don't really care all much too much about movies anymore. But yeah, this is pretty bad for Black Adam. But yeah, Black Panther is expected to go in line of and Thunder and Doctor Strange Multiverse of Madness. It will still not make a billion dollars at the box office. Goodbye.